Cloudcast Media presents from the massive studios in Raleigh, North Carolina. Hello, this is Aaron Dunn. I want to talk to you today a little bit about Apache CloudStack. What we're going to do is to break down the logical architecture. And what we really want to start with here is your hosts. So what is a host? A host can be a bare metal server, or it can be a server containing a hypervisor. It could be um, Zen server, could be KVM, could be vSphere. And what we do is we actually take those hosts, we attach them to some primary storage. Primary storage is really any kind of storage that the hypervisor that you are using within the cluster supports, which that takes us to the next level, the cluster. What we're doing is combining a group of hosts of like type, so like bare metal, like hypervisor, within a cluster. So that is a management point right there. And then you have any number of clusters. So we're kind of scaling up here to you know, n number of clusters. And then we're actually taking that and combining all of that together at, with a layer two switch. And then we're combining all of that into what we call a pod. So think of a pod really as almost like a rack. Um, and you can really combine them in any way, but typically what is done is, is a rack is a cluster. And then from there, we go up to a layer three switch, and you can have multiple pods. So pod one, pod two, et cetera, et cetera. Now, something that is very different about CloudStack is this concept of secondary storage I have sitting down here. And you notice it's really, it's not listed at a pod level. The reason being is this secondary storage is different from primary storage. As this one only supported really what the hypervisor supports, secondary storage is going to be one of two things. It's going to be NFS based or object storage based. And because of having this object storage in particular, we're able to have the secondary storage actually talk across multiple pods. So you can store images on your secondary server or you can actually store snapshots of volumes there. So you can actually copy a snapshot from a primary storage to secondary storage and that image will also be available everywhere. Now, what is actually new in uh, Apache CloudStack 4.2, which will release any day now, is the concept of regions as well. So what we're actually doing is there's a management server that always talks to all of the hosts, the clusters, and the pods. And then what we actually have is a region up here as well. And what a region does allows you to kind of do geographic disbursement of your, if you want to do different data centers with different management servers, allows you for compliance reasons, security region, reasons, or just geographic disbursements for disaster recovery as well. And that is a quick introduction to CloudStack. Thank you.